Hello, my name is Vladimir Blatin. I'm a solution architect at Burwood Group. And today I'm going to talk about our portfolio of cloud services and how they fit with the desktop as a service architecture. Our desktop as a service architecture and uh, associated cloud services are based on a classical service delivery model that is driven by uh, ITIL framework. Within the ITIL framework, uh, we have uh, multiple processes defined that essentially govern the whole environment that is implemented in the cloud. The cloud consists of a classical three-tier architecture that includes infrastructure layer, platform layer, and a software layer. They are managed by a collection of uh, um, management tools uh, that include uh, such capabilities as uh, uh, deployment, provisioning, configuration management, monitoring, reporting, and etc. Those in turn are governed by the operational layer uh, that are typically represented by service management tools. And lastly, all of those are feeding the information into a service delivery layer that is exposed to the clients and to the stakeholders of the architecture. So now that we have defined the architectural framework, we can fill it out with a, uh, fill it in with the actual collection of components and tools that we are using to implement that framework. At the bottom layer of the infrastructure, we have uh, our uh, traditional public cloud implementations such as Microsoft Azure or Amazon Web Services. Uh, we have uh, an ability to support uh, uh, private clouds uh, that are implemented uh, using VMware technology in, inside the client's data center. We also have the ability to support uh, hosted private, uh, private cloud providers uh, 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 from companies such as Single Hub. Based on top of this basic infrastructure as a service uh, a collection of components, we now have a collection of platform elements that we're implementing in order to make Based desktop as a service a, a, a complete solution. And those include um, such capabilities as disaster recovery as a service, backup as a service, identity as a service, as well as uh, mobile device management and application delivery controllers. Lastly, on top of that, we now place the uh, um, components of the architecture that are directly usable by the by our users, and those include the actual desktop applications, as well as uh, um, uh, multiple instantiations of uh, virtual desktops uh, through VDI implementation. It also includes mobile applications and file sharing capabilities. All of those taken together are managed through a management layer that in our case consists of a right scale a cloud management platform, uh, Citrix cloud uh, um, components, uh, science logic monitoring components and NetBrain, uh, uh, a network monitoring tool. All of them together feed information into our SRM tool, which uh, happens to be ServiceNow. And all of these, as I mentioned before, are now feeding information into our Burwood portal, that is our uh, interface to clients and stakeholders. Uh, this completes our short presentation of a desktop as a service solution and how it fits into our overall cloud services portfolio. You can find more information at burwood.com. Uh, my name is Vladimir Blatin and thank you for watching.